Hey everyone, I'm the Viking here to do a, another unboxing from Amazon Prime. I'm not going to lie, as somebody who's decided to become an Amazon Prime member, it is totally worth it. I bought these two days ago, and they're here in my hand today. So these are obviously, if you read the title, new headphones. I need new headphones because my old ones are shit, and these are wireless too, and these were on sale, so I figured everything put together, let's see how well this goes. And by the looks of it... This will go pretty well. So this is going to be the first time I do a video like this. So hopefully this goes well as well. You open. You see that? It's got string in it. What? Why is there string? Oh my god. I mean, I guess it keeps it all together. But Jesus Christ, it's a bitch to open. Oh, well. That's the easy way to rip it open. Ow. Yeah, let's just rip this mother open. And get what we're here for. Hey, is there anything else in the box? No. So, here it is. The wireless built-in magnet design up to eight hours battery life. Sound Pete's. Never heard of these before, but they're on sale. It was cheap. Free shipping and everything with Amazon Prime. I figured I'll give it a go. Battery life up to eight hours wireless. Woo! Uh, holds eight hours, yada yada, wingtips, yada yada yada, yada yada yada. So, let's see what these are like. Absolutely. Because, here's the thing, as somebody who really, really, really needs more beats in his life, because my, my ones always, like, my non-wireless ones always just die. I will not allow these to die. Ooh, pretty. I could have just just ripped the box open because, eh. There you go. Upon ripping the box open, because it doesn't really matter. Uh, I I also like how these are going to be wireless, but they've got this. That that's my biggest fun fact here. I like that. So you rip them off. Comes with uh, the quick instructions. Charge, safety place, make sure the current is no greater than one amp. Okie dokie. Pairing, press, press for eight seconds and then enjoy. So the next part of the video is going to be different since to hear them on a wireless thing. And it comes with a um, actually a really cool looking place to hold them. That's actually really cool. I like that. Magnetize as well. Ooh, pretty. Not bad. Not bad at all. So, um, the next part of the video, once I've had a little play of it, would be me just talking. I think that's going to be the easy one there. Fix this. Oh, shit. That's a lot of accessories. For $20 something. Dollars, $23 dollars or something like that? Oh, that's a big one. That's a big, that's a big user manual. Alright, sorry about that cut. So, um, you get a lot in here. I mean, the, these look great. Uh, you've got the sound peat stuff there, the plus, the play, the next one, the charging port. Bit of a downside that they don't actually give you anything to charge it with since they want, I think, one milliamp or something like that. But, I assume the instructions, as big as it is, will tell you. Plus, you know, you could probably just get a hold of them via their card they give you in here, which is brilliant. So if they give it to you in another country, it's good they have that. So overall, it's pretty damn good. Next up, I will actually be playing for a bit, and then we'll go from there, and I'll do a video about that. But for what you get for the money, for like at least on sale for $26 or something, you get a really cool bag. You get accessories. You get a charging cable. And you get them themselves, which actually look pretty damn good. I have to admit, they do look awesome. Alright, I'll be back in a sec for you guys, but for me, it's going to be a while. See you soon. Alright, so I've given these guys a go, and I have to admit, these are pretty damn good. First up, they fit comfortably in the ear. They look weird in the ear. They feel a bit weird when you start off, but they're actually very solid. So you put them in the ear, this little thing here doesn't go around the outside, it goes in the inside to basically... Um, keep it snug in there. And it, it feels pretty damn good. 
And to turn it on, you click the middle button for a few seconds. Um, it turns on, then you can then connect it to your phone. Now, first up, being wireless is great. You can do it like that, have it in the back, have them in your ears like so. Great, you know? You don't have to care about anything to do with cords. You don't have to have a cord here. You can charge your phone, listen to music. It, it It's really well, it's really good. And the quality, it's mixed, right? So the quality is pretty good. First of all, I feel like the quality in this is between medium and good instead of fantastic and great. But it's good enough unless you're a really big fan of like really good beats. But then again, if you're a really good fan, you'd buy those $300 plus uh, wireless ones that they have out there. So yeah, but starting off, these are great. Like these are fantastic wireless. Um, of course, you can't just, you know, snip these off and it's all good. You need this to charge it. But the wireless side of things is pretty good. There's that to plug it in. You've got a good carry bag. Um, nothing really bad to say about that. Just whack him in and stuff, and you're all good. And to be truthful, for 28 bucks, at least on sale, and for me with Amazon Prime, it was so worth it. Like, these are so well made, and the wireless sounds great, and it does sound great. You might need to change some things up, maybe change like your EQ stuff on your phone, but it's fantastic. And the ability to listen to music without the need of having to worry about a line, a cord, and you can, you know, when I'm on the bus or the train, it's a bit hard to get your phone out when you need to, to get somebody's name down. You've got like an earphone, earplug in one ear and stuff. This is, this helps make it so much easier. And for the price point that I got for this, even on the full price, which is like $35, I think it is, it's worth it. Like these are actually worth it. Um, there's no real negative I have. I guess the only real negative is if this line goes you can't you probably won't be able to charge it anymore unless there is another way unless you can fix it yourself um and the fact that the quality it's not bad by any stretch of the imagination it's very good but the quality isn't it will it's it is mixed you know it's not the best it's not the worst it's not it's more in the middle to good i would say Still good though, still good. And I guess it depends. If you're someone that wants a wireless one that and doesn't want to pay like hundred plus dollars for the the um, air, air buds that um, Apple have or any of the higher end wireless ones, these are a good starting one. And I actually say you should do it. Anyway, that's Aussie Viking out. I shall see you on Valhalla. Bye.